In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to integrate fingerprint recognition to an existing application using Touch and Go Biometric Identification Platform by Biometric. The integration is super fast. With just three lines of code, your application will be up and running with fingerprint identification and authentication functionality. Here I have a basic time and attendance software application which uses a user's ID number to identify them. This time and attendance application registers users and then adds them to the database, allowing them to clock in and clock out using their ID number. Using Touch and Go Biometric Identification Platform, I'm going to add fingerprint registration and matching functionality to identify users with their fingerprints. I'm using Visual Studio with C Sharp. Touch and Go Platform is a local web service that exposes both a SOAP and REST endpoints. All programming languages that support these technologies can be used with Touch and Go Platform. So, the first thing that we are going to do is to add service reference. I will add a reference to the local host service of Touch and Go and name it TNG Service Reference. Visual Studio is going to generate all the client classes for communication with this web service. Next, I will declare Touch and Go Client Property and name it TNG. I'll also need a string for session key on the platform. We will discuss the session key a bit later in this video. Then I will create an instance of this client here. Let's go back to the UI screen. The first thing that I need to do is to create a session using the credentials of an administrator of Touch and Go Platform. This person could be, for example, the operator of this application. To make it simple, I will add a new button here and call it Session. Let's change its name and create a new event for it here. I will call the create session on touch and go using the full properties for the parameter. That is auth request info type and I'm going to check the response from here. If it is a success, I will display a message for the user saying session created. This is where I will use that session key property that I created because this method returns a session key that we are going to use on all other calls for Touch and Go Platform. Now, for any reason, if this does not work, then let's show a message using return message type. I'm going to create a button to enroll the fingerprint. The session can be created just once and can be used for the whole day, for example, and for multiple calls on the Touch and Go platform. I will call it Fingerprint and name it here. Let's create an event for this and call it register person. Here I need to provide the session key that I just created and I can supply a person ID. If I don't provide a person ID here, Touch and Go is going to generate a random ID for this user. In this application, we want to use the same ID that is being used in the main application. Let's check if it was successful and display a message fingerprint captured.
If it was not successful, let's display a message with return message. Now, instead of using the ID to clock in and clock out, we want to use fingerprint. So we can remove this and every time a user clicks on clock in or clock out, we want the fingerprint capture window to open. I will call touch and go search. I do not need to supply anything. If the response code is hit confirmed, it means that someone was found with that fingerprint. I'm going to get the user with that ID from the database. I will use person found ID and display a message hello and the name of the person. If the user is not found or if there is an error, let's show a different message. Let's run this application again. Create a session. I will place the admin finger on the fingerprint scanner and a session is created. I will register a new user, in this case myself, as John. The fingerprint registration window opens. It asks for my right index finger. I will place my right index finger three times on the fingerprint scanner. Now it asks for my left index finger. I will place my left index finger three times on the fingerprint reader. My fingerprints were successfully captured and I am being added to the database. Let's click on Clock In. It asks for my fingerprint. I will place my finger on the fingerprint scanner. It identified me as John. In this demo video, we saw how easy and fast it is to add fingerprint recognition into an existing application using Touch and Go Biometric Identification Platform by Biometric. Touch and Go Identity Platform rapidly enables developers to integrate fingerprint registration, fingerprint matching, deduplication, and fingerprint quality check functionalities. With just three method calls, we can add fingerprint recognition in our application.